What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2022 Hit Parade Basketball. Jazbees exclusive dual case break. Random teams number seven just sold out. And again, guys, 20 total boxes, two cases, and we do have a hit list giveaway. So we'll do the break. We'll, we'll count up the hit list customers. Potentially, there will be at least 10 since there is only 20 cards popping out of here, 30 teams. But there could be more. Uh, basically, we'll gather up all those names at the end that went hit list, randomize those names only, and top two names win boxes of Optic Asia Basketball 21-22. Alrighty, so let's do the break. Here's the dice roller. Here's the customer names that bought in from Timothy all the way down to um, Steve Birch, who won those from Pack Fillers and also got Last Bomb Mojo there. Then there's the teams. So let's roll the dice. We got a three and a six for nine times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three, six, nine. Bobby at the top and a Matt Bristow at the bottom. Nine times. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. Nine times. Portland at the top, down to the San Antonio Spurs. So there you go. That's what you match up with there. So, Bobby, you have the Portland Trailblazers. Brett with the Lakers. John with the Jazz. Steve Birch with the Timberwolves. Pacers, Knicks, Thunder, Wizards, Nets. Herman, you have the Heat. Steve Rich with the Mavericks, Suns, Bucks, Warriors, Clippers, Timothy with the Nuggets, Steve with the Grizzlies, Brad with the Pistons, Bobby with the Bulls, Steve with the Hawks, Pam with the Pelicans, Brian, you have the Sacramento Kings, Steve with the Celtics, Rockets, Nicholas with the 76ers, uh, KY with the Cavs, Bennett with the Raptors, Mark with the Magic, Steve with the Hornets, and Matt Bristol, you have the Spurs. Now, I will have a trade window open, guys. I won't pause the video. I'll just give it like 30 seconds to a minute. If we have a trade, we'll do it. If we don't, then we'll close the trade window. But if you want to trade for a team, potentially, that you're looking for, chat it in the chat. If I don't get any responses, it's pretty dead. We'll just close it. Also, too, guys, the the next hip parade, number eight, is the last hip parades we have. Now, we have been selling uh, cases as well on Instagram, so I think pretty much... We were down to three left, so I just took two of them and marked them to save them for number eight. And then uh, the one loose case that's over there still will be for Instagram. So it looks like Instagram might, could have sold quite a few hit parade boxes because I didn't see any more over there. I only seen three. So I assume that uh, we, we went through quite a few over there on Instagram.
All right, guys. I guess no trades. Show you when the close in. Who's that? Hits here, ten hits in the next case. How about a Cade Cunningham to start us off for the Detroit Pistons? Going to Brett Foy. Now, there is some Cade Cunninghams on the sell sheet. Now, I think we were only previewing like 12. We actually had a, a ton of cases, so. There might potentially be more that maybe just wasn't photoed or, you know, something similar. So this Kate is probably a very nice big hit, uh, but it's not photoed to my knowledge. But very nice one there to start us off. So Kate Cunningham for Brett and the Pistons. That's a Prism rookie autograph. And wow, how about a Josh Giddy? Kate and a Giddy? And I don't think this is a sell sheet hit, but damn, this is a very nice hit too. Thunder, OKC, Steve Birch with my Thunder. Thunder up. Nice. Two very nice hits to start off the case. A SGA rookie, so it doesn't have the rookie logo on it, but this is a rookie SGA, and that's going to the Clippers since he was drafted by the Clippers in a rookie year. Uh, Clippers going to Steve Birch as well. Very nice, man. SGA Thunder up. All right. I must say three solid boxes. Jesus. All right, let's go. We have a Jalen Brunson. I remember I remember a couple years ago, man, you didn't want to get this guy. You wanted to get Luka Doncic. But now Brunson, of course, is a pretty big time player. Of course, not on the on the Mavericks anymore, but this card will be going to the Mavericks, which is also Steve Birch. That is to ninety nine. After this, halfway through the first case. And Tyrese Halliburton. That's going to Brian and the Sacramento Kings. Again, another player that's not on the Kings anymore, but rookie year. Rookie-wise, he is a king there. Got a very nice three color patch there, quad relic, 
Uh, Cole Anthony. That's number to 49. 35 out of 49 for the Orlando Magic, which is going to mark. And we got a out of 49 pen pals. That's Jaden McDaniels. Another solid player that's, uh, of course, rookie year-wise. You want Anthony Edwards, not him, but great player. Milwaukee, or not Milwaukee, Minnesota. That's going to Steve Birch. And we have a... DeJounte Murray. That is 94 out of 99. Now, this is a collegiate product, which I believe if we go look at the official checklist, it's not going to have the team name affiliated with it. Um, so we would have to go to Group Break Checklist. If Group Break Checklist has a proper checklist for 2016 Contenders draft picks, it's going to go to the team that he was there currently that year. But uh, if not, it's going to have to go by college rules teams that are currently on or teams that play for the longest now i know dejounte murray he's he was a spur i don't know if he's still there is he still there i don't think so right so we'll come back to that right now once i get done with these two boxes and we'll take a look but that's where it gets a little tricky sometimes with the collegiate stuff if he's still a spur then it's gonna go to the spurs but i'm not too too sure yet all right, then we got a silver screen debut from Noir. That is Trey Murphy to 99. That is Pelicans with the hit there. There you go. I am with that one. And last one before we move on to the next case. is a Julius Randall. And again, that's Lakers rookie edition for from Excalibur. Three color patch, piece of the basketball to 349. Lakers going to Brett. All right, let's take a look really quick. So, it looks like, guys, there is no contenders draft picks collegiate basketball on group break checklists at all, besides uh, only 2021. None, uh, they have 2018, they have 2019, but nothing as, uh, as, as far back as 2016. So, and I'll show you guys here. So, 2016, Contenders Draft Picks Basketball, no checklist. So, since there is no checklist, guys, uh, that has to go to by college rules. Teams he's currently on, teams he played for the longest. He did. He did get drafted by the Spurs, but he's no longer a Spurs since there is no checklist. If that would have had a team logo on there, then, yeah, we'd give that to the Spurs right away. But now he's currently Atlanta Hawk. So, that would be going to Steve Birch. So. Yeah, but he's not out of the league. He's currently active. So, our college rules, if you go to our uh, FAQ, college rules is teams they're currently on, they go there. Or, if they're out of the league, retired, teams they play for the longest. So, that goes to Atlanta. Yeah, but that's the tricky thing with collegiate products. They don't really give you a proper checklist. So if group break checklist that we use doesn't have one, then you kind of really can't do anything about it. And that's how we establish our rules here. So ATL. So there you go. 
All right, now let me quickly also to copy and paste the list that people have gone hitless. Okay, so Atlanta Hawks, not hitless. Lakers got a hit, hitless no more. Pelicans, hitless no more. Minnesota, Steve, hitless no more. Uh, Magic, hitless no more. Sacramento Kings, hitless no more. Uh, Dallas, hitless no more. OKC, or not OKC, sorry, that's Clippers. LAC, no more. Then OKC, no more. And Detroit. So there you go. So we had 10 different people. Not part of the hitless promo no more. Now let's find out and see how many more we're going to add to the promo or deduct from the promo. Here we go. And for the Cavs, that's Jared Allen. Two color patch and autograph there to 50 from Immaculate. That's going to the Cavaliers, which KY and the Hitless no more. There you go on the board. Paul Pierce signatures from Upper Deck 2003 2004 24 out of 50 now again same thing college rules here he's currently not active and I believe he played for the Celtics the longest but let's just double check on the checklist but I think at that time he should have been a Celtic there let's take a look at that these cards man these cards were so banging at one point these uh 2013 cards. They were sick right there. Alright, let's see. 2013. Upper deck. I do miss upper deck making basketball cards though. Like, like, uh, exquisite. This was all time grades, right? Yeah, all time grades. Yeah, so they actually have the checklist, but it doesn't have a team affiliated to it. So that'll go to the team he played for the longest, which is Boston. So just to show you. They have the checklist. It just doesn't have the team affiliated to it. So at the time, guys, I think previous to like 2013, 2014, it was really hard to get checklists, honestly. They didn't really actually add teams to any checklist. I really liked until like 2015, probably. Which is sucks, but I guess people didn't really care for... You know what it is, actually? I take that back. It's for breaking, actually. I think breaking really took off, you know, 2015, 16. It just started getting really big. Kind of like when we were getting into it, 2014, 2015, it really took off. So 
I feel like before Checklist, they didn't care if there was a team affiliated next to it or not. But I think once they we start, you start breaking and breaking older products, you know, Checklist is the one thing you go by, especially if you're looking for redemptions and whatnot. So I feel like at yeah, 2015, Upper Deck and all these different companies decided to start adding the team next to the name. So that way there's kind of an affiliation for, uh, for Checklist. All right, nice Donovan Mitchell. That is a black box one of one. I believe this is actually on the sell sheet. Yep. Sell sheet hit right there, guys. There's that Donovan Mitchell right there. So that's a black box one of one. Going to the Utah Jazz and John. So, John, you are hitless no more. Let's uh, take you off there. So, Steve, we're going to take you out there for Boston and Utah. John, hitless no more. All right, next one. And Jerry West for the Lakers. Brett with the Lakers. And I believe Lakers already hit, so that's our first repeat hit. the Atlanta Hawks Steve Burks that is a green of Dominique Wilkins and that's numbered one out of eight there you go so Atlanta Hawks of course I've already hit so hitless no more well actually it's your second hit already on this so not part of the promo uh explain the hit list what do you mean by that man sorry for what break or what for what Oh, like a sell sheet? So if you look on the website, there's like, I don't know, 12, 13 cards as the as the photo for the for this specific break. Those are basically like preview cards that uh, are going to be part of this series in 30 cases. So, you know, when we hit one, kind of like to say, hey, look, it's a sell sheet. That means that it was probably one of the biggest cards in the whole 30 case print run, basically. So that Donovan Mitchell was a big hit for this case and just in general. And for Detroit, Grant Hill, 18 out of 49. So that kind of gives you a little bit of a, a chase, you know, like, oh, man, there's that really sweet Cape Cunningham that's in that product. So I have the opportunity to hit that, but, you know, obviously you have to get randomized the Detroit Pistons first and then obviously be lucky enough to get the case that has that specific hit. So it's just more kind of a chasers, we like to call them. Just to entice people to want to buy in, right? If you want that specific card, it's going to be available in one of these cases. We just don't know which one. And Brandon Clark, which I think is a solid player as well. Again, another player that really wanted probably John Morant more than this guy, but this guy's great. 54 out of 99 playoff ticket, contenders ticket. Playoff. And uh, that is Grizzly Steve Birch. All right, three more to go, guys. And for Philly, Markel's Fultz. That's a rookie autograph on card from Revolution. Number 35 out of 50. And for the 76ers... First time hitting is Nick, so hitless no more, man, but nice hit right there. Fultz, of course, has had a little shaky career, you know, being a, having that shoulder injury and then just never panning out there. Got some minutes and got some time in Orlando. Did okay. I don't know if he's even still on the team or what, but it's kind of one of those first-round picks that uh, hasn't lived up to the potential. But a hit's a hit, though. And, wow, another Hakeem. Didn't we get one? Oh, no, we got Dominique Wilkins, actually. Sorry. Hakeem the Dream. 
49 out of 49 for the Rockets. I think that's the Rockets' first hit, right? Yes, Steve Birch. So you got Dominic Wilkins and Hakeem now. Alrighty, and down to the last boss, guys. So hopefully one new hit in here for a team that hasn't hit. But again, if you haven't hit, don't worry. You will have a chance to get something back in return. Uh, top two get an optic uh, team all box sent to you, which is probably, I think, I assume, pretty close to the spot price, if not more. Might be like about a $100 box. And it is for the Spurs, Tony Parker. So the DeJounte Murray got kind of taken away. But you did get a Tony Parker here, though, Matt Bristow. And there you go, man. Three-color patch. That's numbered 17 out of 20 uh, from Noir Basketball 1718. So there you go. And just like that, guys. So let me double-check the hit list customers again. So Spurs taking out Rockets. Taken out. Philly taken out. Uh, Grizzlies taken out. Pistons taken out. Atlanta Hawks taken out. Lakers taken out. Utah Jazz taken out. Boston taken out. Cavs taken out. Detroit taken out. OKC taken out. Clippers taken out. Dallas taken out, uh, Kings taken out, Orlando Magic taken out, Minnesota taken out, Pelicans taken out, Lakers taken out, and then of course Atlanta taken out. Yep. All right, guys. So there you go. So basically, the customers here on the right side, if your name is still there, that means that your team went hitless. So I think it was about like 13 different names. So, we have a 2 and 13 shot to get something back in return. So, let's make some, take the spaces out. Alright, so there you go, guys. Good luck. Let's dice roll it to 2 and a 6 eight times. Good luck. 1, 2, 3, Four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time, guys. Here we go. Boom. Eight times, eight times, two and a six. Steve Birch and Herman. Congratulations. A little extra something. I, I believe those optic boxes are pretty close to the spot price, so we'll ship you those optic boxes each. You guys get one each, and it is from 2021 uh, 22 Optic Asia Basketball. So we'll ship those out to you guys. Appreciate it, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.